When Mary was a little girl, she loved music. One day she picked up a guitar and played and wrote songs and sang. Until she became famous for playing her music all over the world. When Darcy was a little girl, she loved puppets. One day she made a puppet, then made another, and another, and another, until her puppets became famous all over the world. And then it happened. Mary and Darcy met. And Mary's music and Darcy's puppets became Mary Rice Hopkins and Puppets with a Heart. One, two, three, four. Hey, Scruffy, come here. Look, Scruffy, Santa Claus came early. I'm definitely not on the naughty list. Look at all these. For me, I, oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy, I don't know where to start. Oh, hi, Mary. Hi, Ono. Oh, time. I love the cookies, the decorations, and all these gifts. Christmas joy comes from getting lots and lots of gifts and toys, and all these gifts are for me. For me. For me. For me. For me. For me. 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 Oh, no, oh, no. These boxes are not for you. She's just kidding around, Scruffy. I've been such a good boy this year. Do you remember the first time you received a gift and how excited you were? Yeah. Well, think about the excitement a child might feel the first time he ever opens a gift. So what's in the box? Well, oh no, it's, it's not just toys, but it's things we sometimes take for granted, like a toothbrush and also some socks. Socks and toothbrush? For Christmas? But Scruffy, we need to look around these boxes. Surely there's some for me. Help me find boxes with my name on them. The more boxes for me, the more Christmas joy I will have. Oh no, Christmas is not just about receiving, but about giving also. Well, what do you mean? I think she's had too much eggnog or too many gingerbread cookies. Christmas joy is about a much greater gift. What gift is that? God sent his only son to be born on Christmas Day. It's Jesus' birthday, and that's the greatest gift ever given. Whoa! Oh no, and Scruffy, let me introduce you to the Christmas Box Children.
Gary, where are you? Oh, Christmas joy comes from shopping. This one thing I know. Christmas joy comes from shopping. Never let it go. Christmas joy comes from shopping. This one Gringo. thing I know. What's with all the bags? I thought you were helping Darcy with the Operation Christmas Child boxes. Oh, I thought we had a shopping day. I brought all these empty bags so that so we could use them to take you shopping. Good idea, Gringo! And you think that I'm supposed to fill all these bags with everything on your list? Yep, that's right. Let's go. What are you waiting on? There's some great sales going on right now. Well, actually, Gringo, this Christmas, we're going to make it about giving to others and about Operation Christmas Child. Does that mean I'm not getting anything for Christmas? Oh, no, Gringo. It's just that this Christmas, we're going to think of others first. You know, I think we need to check your heart. Okay. It's under my armpit. Tickle spot. Oh, Gringo, you have ribbon in your heart, lots of ribbon, and you have a me button? My favorite thing about Christmas is seeing all that stuff wrapped up for me. Ripping off the wrapping paper and tearing into the package and then, ta-da! It's all about me getting the right gift. Yeah, and tearing into the gifts is so much fun! Yeah, it's so much fun! <laughs> yeah, so much fun! Can't wait! Can't wait! Oh, guys, I think we should take this out and I think you need to think about this. think about is what's on your Christmas list? Well, kind of. Sometimes I can't even sleep at night thinking about all the things I'm getting. Um, all I'm right, ready. guys. Over to the couch. I think it's time for a heart check.
Well, as I said earlier, oh no, we need to see what's inside. Wow, you do have something in your heart, Ono. Oh it's a very long Christmas list. <laughs> wow, it's a coloring book, a drum set, a keyboard, a trumpet, a guitar, a swing set, a trampoline, a basketball, goggles, snorkels. My goodness, how do you know, Ono, oh you're gonna get everything on this list? Well, that's easy to figure out because I email Santa Claus three times a day, I Twitter him every hour, I use Facebook MySpace daily, I fax him weekly, Santa still has a fax? I sent him five letters in the mail, and I waited two hours in line at the mall to hand deliver him my list. Well, Ono, oh Santa is fun, but the things that we get on this list, they're just temporary. But the things that come from Jesus that we talked about will last forever. Well, Jesus might be the best gift, but Santa Claus is the best, best story. I have a Bible verse. In John 3.16, it says, read along, For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish, but have everlasting life. Now I'm going to wow. tell Does that mean I live forever and ever? That's right, Ono. And I'm going to take the scripture and I'm going to put it back in your heart because cool. that's <laughs> the best story of Oh. This is fun! It's like a big party filling these shoe boxes. These boxers are such a good idea. We could get rid of all of our old toys and give them to the kids and make room for the new toys. Hey guys, these are kind of old and worn out. Oh no, a half a peanut butter sandwich and yuck, gringo. Look at this, the arm is missing. Oh. They're just well loved. I think you should give up some of your allowance to make these special boxes. Give up my allowance? We should give these children our best gift because it comes from our hearts. But how am I going to buy everything at the after Christmas sales if, if I use my money for the boxes? You know, Gringo, I know it would be a sacrifice to give up your allowance, but there's a lot of joy in giving. In fact, Gringo, God gave us his greatest gift of all. And what gift was that, Ono? Um, um, oh, that's the scripture you put in my heart. Haley, can you come help me, please? <laughs> oh, yeah, you're my good helper. Now, if I she mess up, is. please help me, okay? For, for God so loved world. The world <laughs> that, that he gave us only. Begotten Son. Begotten Son. That whosoever shall believe it in him should not perish. Perish. But have a everlasting life. Everlasting life. That's great. Oh, oh no, we're so proud of you. And that's exactly what happened, is that God gave his only son as the greatest gift. And I believe there was a big celebration in the barn and in the right. heavens. And you know, it was almost like a big party. You know what? We should get the sheep to help us. Good and idea. maybe we could get these boxes done a whole lot sooner. Mm -hmm. In fact, they could be our sheep helpers. Sort of like a sheep party. these boxes. Sounds and good. You know what? I'm going to go send the kids in for the sheep party. A sheep party celebrating God's greatest gift on the day Jesus was born. The sheep were lost in the middle of the night. The star was shining oh so bright. The shepherds led them to a light. Up in the 
it can weigh up high Down in the manger Jesus lies The shepherds and the kids and the wise guys Singing hallelujah Hallelujah It's a sheep party like never before They let a man through the old barn door There's no sheep walking anymore Yeah, the animals sing to the king Creation brings its praise to the Lord The sheep were lost in the middle of the night The star was shining oh so bright The shepherds led them to a light Singing hallelujah, singing hallelujah! Gringo, what's with the bell in the bucket? Well, Mary, you came to me when you said I should use my allowance to buy some gifts for the shoeboxes. Well, I'm going to need some extra money for this year for the things I want to buy after Christmas. What? I remember seeing a guy standing outside the grocery store. He had a bell in a bucket, and when people walked in and out of the grocery store, they dropped money in the bucket. I thought that was a great idea. Gringo, wait a minute. Those people ringing the bell outside the store are from the Salvation Army. They're collecting money for, for people who don't have anything at all at Christmas. And they're needy people. Well, I'm needy because I need more money. I'll just be outside ringing my bell and taking my bucket out there with me. Gringo, Gringo, stop. God is using us and others to deliver these shoe boxes to children around the world. In the same way, the wise men and the shepherds, they took their gifts on camels and gave them to baby Jesus. Whoa, so we're like wise men when we make these boxes because we're providing gifts for those in need. Yeah, gringo, now you're getting it. We need to get these shoe boxes ready. So look up, the camels are coming. The camels are coming? Gringo, I'm so glad you're excited about giving. 
I know that Darcy and I took on a really big project. We could have just done a few boxes for a few children. So why are we doing so many? Inside these shoe boxes are more than just toys and goodies. There's something special that we put inside of them. What could be better than a new toy? Well, with each box, there's a pamphlet that we put inside in the child's own language that tells the true meaning of Christmas. You mean a booklet that tells them about Jesus coming to this earth and how much he loves them? Yeah, we become a candle that spreads the love of Jesus with each box that we make. Wow! Wow! So cool! So cool! I wish I could see their faces when they open the box! Well, you can, Ono. Hey, Scruffy. Hey, could you get the Operation Christmas Child up on the computer over here? Thanks, bud. I always want to be a candle that shares the light of Jesus. Me too! Just one can light the way Just one can kneel and pray Just one can come and say It's time to load the boxes into the truck. Everybody, come on. So Gringo, why don't you go and make sure all of the boxes are loaded into the truck? That's all the boxes! I'm so excited! We're sending God's love into the entire world! That's right, Ono, and children all over the world are going to have something to smile about this Christmas. Playing with the mariachi band With the steel guitar underneath the stars Playing Feliz Navidad in the sand Feliz Navidad Go telling on the mountains Over the hills and everywhere Go telling on the mountains That Jesus Christ is born 
want to go down to Wacky Key with my hula skirt and my ukulele. Meili Kaligi Maka. A Christmas even comes in Hawaii. And you can even hang your stockings. Tiny bubbles. Oh, tell it on the mountains, over the hills and I'll do my karaoke, yes I can With my, my Korean, Korean band With my big and little fan Go tell it on the mountains Over the hills and everywhere Go tell it on the mountains That Jesus Christ is born I want to go down to Africa, where the rhythm and beat will move with ya. In the air, everywhere, dancing feet that go and share. Germany was the first Christmas tree. Los, lass uns ein Weihnachtsbaum kaufen. And to live their Messiah in the air. They do the polka and they really rock. Germany rocks. <laughs> Dropping your bell. <laughs> hey, Elle, what's, what's in the bag that you brought for us to build the shoe boxes with? Um, glasses. Oh, glasses. Oh, that's cool. That's a good gift. What else did you bring? Hey, what is that? It's, it's a race car. Oh, oh, I like race cars. What else do you got there, Johnny? Not a race car. Another, you like cars, huh? The kids around the world are gonna love the cars. What else you got there? Markers. Oh, markers. The kids love to do art stuff, don't you? Do you, Sammy? Mm-hmm. Oh, what else you got? Mirrors. Oh, I, I think your sister may have packed that for you. That's a mirror and comb, but that's really nice because the girls around the world like those. <gasps> it's for you, it's a diamond. Oh, well, there's no more. No more? Okay, thank 